The best way to see what's going on with an AC system is to get accurate gauge readings and that's for the low and the high side of the system. Uh, the self-charging kits or the do-it-yourselfer type uh, charging kits um, may, if you're lucky, may give you a gauge reading for the low side but it will not give you a gauge reading for the high side at all. Some of the, the do-it-yourselfer kits don't allow you to even know what the low side reading is not have any indication of uh, where that's at. Um, so it's very important to go ahead and get a, a gauge set, an AC manifold gauge set, and um, hook up and get the, get the readings low and high side. Um, once you know that then you'll be able to determine what's going on with the system, if it's a low charge, um, if uh, the readings are too high, it could be overcharged. Um, there's a variety of different pressure readings and uh, they all mean different things. Um, <clears throat> but anyways, um, get, get an ANC gauge set if you don't have one. Uh, you can find one like, um, like this one right here. And then also if you have a R12 or R22 old gauge set that's not being used anymore, then um, a lot of our customers do still, uh, surprisingly they're still around, you can convert them over to the 134A by using this FJ6025 kit. This comes with quick disconnect couplers for the high and low side and also the adapter, the small brass adapt adapter down to the right bottom is for the yellow hose and that would be for hooking to the um, the charging tap, the can tap, or a uh, virgin tank, or even hooking to the, uh, the vacuum pump. So that would make your old obsolete gauge set usable once again.